Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. And I think to myself, what a wonderful So today's video is another weekly vlog. We are starting it off on Sunday, April 11th. Let me just check. Yeah, April 11th. And it's about like five o'clock already. It's 5.30 actually. Um, I did get up at a reasonable time today. Um, last night I was having like some feverish symptoms and stuff from getting my COVID vaccine. I just got the Johnson & Johnson vaccine yesterday. And so yeah, I was feeling like feverish last night and like just overall not feeling good at all. Um, but today I woke up feeling totally fine. Um, I feel great. I think I'm even gonna do like, I was thinking like a low impact workout today, like yoga or just a walk in the neighborhood. I think I'm gonna do yoga though, but it's such a pretty day outside. I might go for a walk. We'll see. But um, yeah, I filmed a TikTok earlier today to show my uh, makeup. I just did like a peachy makeup look. I don't know, I did some layered necklaces. I'm wearing my Roxbox earrings for the month. And um, this I just got at a, at a, what do you call those, at a trade show. Um, this is Charming Charlie's. I have my, I think this is from Aerie, the shirt, babe. It's super comfy. Um, but yeah, uh, I did a TikTok earlier and then me and my mom went to Walmart, got some groceries. I tried to check out their wax section, but I accidentally went to the wrong Walmart. Um, this one does not have a lot of wax. Um, the one that I went to to do my like wax walkthrough video is a different one and that one had a lot more stuff. So I'm gonna have to go to that one again soon. Um, but yeah, I need to edit my vlog for the past week which I need to do that right now and then unload these this load of laundry that's clean. Um, but I wanted to show you guys at Walmart, they had some really cute stuff and they had these like little skirts. They had them in so many different colors, but it has like a little slit in the front. I just think it looks really, really cute. So I think I'm gonna try it on and show you guys if it looks cute or not. Um, but they had it in a lot of colors and they had a lot of shorts and some swimsuits. They were just starting to put out their swimsuits and stuff. So I think I'm gonna check back in like a month or so um, and see if they've put out more stuff. But so far it looks like some cute stuff. They even had some cute dresses, but you could tell like they had already been picked through. They didn't have a lot left. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and try that skirt on and see how it looks. Okay, here's the skirt tag. So you can see NVA line mini skirt, 9.98. I got a size small, but I think I actually should have gotten a medium because it's kind of bunching up right here. Like it's a little too tight and I was walking around earlier and it was just like sl slinking up. Um, but it's actually really cute. So I would definitely probably go get a medium and just exchange it. But I think it's like the perfect length where it's not too short, but it's not too long. I think it's actually really cute, um, but probably would size up since this is Junior's sizing. So yeah, I think it is cute though. Well, with that, I am gonna go um, change out of the skirt and edit the vlog and probably a few more videos if I can. And then um, I'll go do my little low impact exercise and I'll see you guys later. Hello guys, it is currently Thursday the 15th. It's nighttime, I just showered. I actually need to go brush my teeth and stuff, but I'm doing like my self tanner right now. But I figured I would show you guys a couple things that I picked up today. So I actually got in a Mercari order and then I also went to Walmart during my lunch break and I had to go drop off something at the FedEx pickup in Walmart. And so then I just kind of like shopped. So let me show you what I got. Okay, so the first thing that I got is dun -dun -dun -dun, pumpkin donut shop. So I went ahead and I, I I really missed the one that I had just finished off. I think I finished it off last month and I've just been craving it ever since. So I bit the bullet and I bought it on Mercari. I think this was like 20 bucks plus shipping and the seller shipped it beautifully, like perfectly wrapped, double bubble wrapped and uh, more wrapping on top of the bubble wrap in a very tight and secure package. And I was super impressed. I need to go write her a really good review. Um, but yeah, I bought another pumpkin donut shop. So very excited to have it. It smells just like the other one did. So good. Basically just like powdered sugar donut. It's, it's a favorite of mine. So, um, I needed a backup of it. And, um, this is actually, um, 
okay according to my low buy if you guys didn't know i'm on a low buy right now for candles so for every four full-size candles that i finish i can buy one new one so i had finished four up and now i can buy one new one so this is the new one that i chose instead of getting like an actual an actual new one i got one from last fall so yeah this is what i got from mercari and then i will show you guys what i got from walmart so i just kind of like laid it all out right here ow i just hit my back on my table um so the first thing i got are these little like slides now i i don't know how i feel about these type of slide mule kind of things because they don't have a back to them so i feel like they're just gonna slip off your feet but for $9, I'll try it. Um, they're originally 15, so it's not like it's that much of a deal. Um, and I wear a seven and a half, so I figured I'll try them. They're really cute. Um, maybe even just for like an outfit or something, but really cute. And then they had this whole wall of these like plain, um, hello, here's the packaging out of it, um, ball caps. And they had them in every color you can imagine, like khaki, purple, red, blue denim um, and it's kind of like you can't really tell but it's kind of um, like the washed feel if you know what I mean um, pink washed blank cap okay yeah so they had ones with stuff on it like they had one this exact color but with a rainbow but I didn't like that one um, they were $4.97 so basically five bucks and yeah this is like a really pretty rose color on the camera it kind of looks a lot lighter or like yeah, it looks a lot lighter than it actually is, but it's definitely like a dusty rose. And I just thought it'd be really cute for like summertime when I don't want to do my hair. <laughs> um, and then I found these biker shorts. Um, well, actually, they're like biker shorts underneath and then like regular shorts on top. Um, and they like scrunch on the side. I thought these are so cute. Walmart really has some good workout clothes. If you guys haven't tried Walmart's workout clothes, especially the Avia brand, it's a really good brand. I had some leggings from there that lasted me like literally six years. So yeah, um, these were $11.96. I hope they fit. I don't really know. Um, sometimes with biker shorts, it's hard to tell. Either I'm a small or a medium. So we'll just see. Um, but the really pretty color and I had not seen these before. And then these other shorts that I got are so cute. Um, so they're basically like, they're showing up kind of a weird color on camera, but they are basically um, like uh, the color of starfish. Do you know what I mean? Like they're the, kind of like orange, but it's like a burnt orange, but not quite longhorns, UT burnt orange. Um, it's a really pretty color for summer. So they're very casual and cute, but I can dress it up with like a, either like a white button down or like a white um, crop top or something cute and they have pockets and yeah I think these will just be really cute to just throw on for summer and then over here I did go down the wax aisle every chance I get I'll go to a new Walmart and look at their wax so um, I've been thinking about getting some like cheaper wax for the, my warmer at work because I don't want to like choke people out my all of our offices are like connected through the ceiling so they can all smell what I'm burning so I'm trying to get stuff that doesn't throw too high like I really want stuff that you like can almost barely smell um so I have a few melts from the Dollar Tree that I've been burning lately and it's really just like I think one is like um toasted marshmallow and the other one's vanilla so I wanted a little bit of a different feel so I got the 99 cent ones from Mainstays and Sugared Berries. It just literally smells like berries. And then apple cider donut. It smells so good. Mm. It smells like apples. It smells so good. And then I got another, uh, like a pack of bulbs just in case some of my bulbs run out. But yeah, I plan on leaving these at work and seeing how they throw. Um, I'm hoping that they're like not not high throwers you know it's not often that you don't want something to be like really strong but i really don't want strong scents so let me know if you guys um know some brands that are like really light throwers because that's what i'm trying to get for my office i just want me to smell it not the entire office but anyways yeah that is the haul and that's really all that i have to share for today <laughs> Saturday April 17th and 
Me and my mom actually just went to Marshall's. I had to go get an oil change, so we dropped off my car and then we went shopping at Marshall's and I picked up a lot of stuff. They had some good clearance clothes and then I picked up some other random knickknacks. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys that now. So a couple random things, I just got some black peppercorns. I've been looking for a sifter um, because I've been seeing all the ones that they had out for Easter, but I just wanted like a plain one. So I found this Ray Dunn one, how perfect. Uh, it was $5.99. And then I found these two little birdies. They had a ton of different ones, but these are so cute. And I figure they'll be really cute um, with our decor. And then I think these are $5.99 each, yeah. And then the clothes, okay, some really cute stuff. Um, the first one I found this little like bodysuit from um, Aerie, $9.99. I always find really cute like American Eagle Aerie stuff there. So, and then I think this is my favorite thing that I found, this jacket was on clearance for 15 bucks, originally 40. I don't know this brand, Blank NYC, but it's like tufted almost. It's literally like a comforter. It's so soft and like a peach color. And then I got this in two different colors. It's like a little sweatshirt, a little crop sweatshirt with like cute little detail on the sleeves. So I got it in this like charcoal gray and army green, pretty much. Super cute. Um, these were, originally 30 on sale for 12. And then the last thing I got is this little like puff sleeve shirt. I just thought this neckline is so pretty. And then puff sleeves. I don't even know if I like the color, but it's not bad. It's just like kind of odd, uh, but for $4, I figured I'd just try it and see if I like this neckline and stuff. So yeah, really cute. Got some adorable stuff. Did I need it? No. Am I happy I got it? Yes. <laughs> okay guys, it is much later on Saturday night. And I got in this Amazon order last night, actually, and I forgot to show you guys, but I ordered a candle warmer. So I finally have a candle warmer. I really, really wanted one because some candles just get too sooty and I don't, I don't want to burn them anymore. They're just too much. And so, um, I got one, the one that Mr. Kong's mom recommends, which also is the one that Ashley Nicole uses. And so it's good to know that other people like this one. And so that's why I got it. And I'm primarily, I got this for this Goose Creek uh, white icing cinnamon roll candle because even though, okay, so you can see this whole layer of like city wax. Well, I, <laughs> I already, okay, look, it was up to here and all the wax was city. And so I <laughs> got it all melted and poured it out that's why I even had any progress in the last month. And then it just became sooty again when I burned it. So I just think it's a problem with this candle. And so I'm going to put it in a wax warmer. I mean, a candle warmer, candle crock, whatever you want to call this. Um, and just see if it works. Um, sorry, my, <laughs> my thermometer's on here from last week when I got my COVID vaccine and had a fever. But anyways, yeah, so I'm excited to see how that works. Um and to see if it works and if I like it and all that kind of stuff. Um, but I also got um, this whole pack of like really thick headbands in a bunch of colors. And um, this has been like a new trend, but it's really like a 90s slash 2000s trend to have the big chunky headbands. Um, but nowadays you'll like pull out two front pieces of hair. I just thought it looked really cute and so I wanted to try it. This is like a $5 pack of headbands on Amazon. And then I got these earrings, which I actually wore today. So they're up here. Um, let's see. These little guys, um, they are from the brand Pavoy. Um, they came in a really cute little box, but they're just like these little mini hoops. And I thought they were adorable because I've been really like loving lately the whole double hoop trend. And um, I think it's really from the girls on The Bachelor. Um, they were wearing it like all season long. And so I I do have a second piercing um, on my ear. So I'll do these in the big one and then these in the side. Isn't that cute? Just like super simple. I don't know. So yeah, that's why I got those and they're really pretty. I wore them today already. So yep. And here's me after my shower. <laughs> But yeah, that's about it for today. Um, I just watched Falcon and Winter Soldier with my mom and the most recent episode of RuPaul's Drag Race. And we also found out that you can watch season 12, which is the previous season on our TV downstairs for um, like Xfinity. So she's been watching that like all day today. And yeah, that's, 
that's pretty much everything that happened today. Um, tomorrow we are actually helping my brother and his girlfriend move into their apartment. So, um, it'll be like an early day for me, um, just helping them move a bunch of furniture back and forth. And yeah, that should be fun. Um, but yeah, it's really cool. I'm really proud of him. He's moving out. He's, him and his girlfriend are so sweet. And yeah, so very exciting things. And then also, um, I plan on using his room as a workout room. He's not really moving any of his furniture. Um, so I'm just gonna like clean a little section of his room out and put a stationary bike there because apparently we've had a stationary bike in the garage for like the past year and a half and I didn't even know about it. Um, apparently my my dad bought it like five years ago. So I'm gonna put a stationary bike in his room and like watch Peloton videos or something and try that. I've always meant to try the stationary bike stuff. Um, so now that I know that we actually have a bike in the garage, um, I can do that. So yeah, um, that's my plans for his room. Don't tell him. Um, anyways, <laughs> so, but yeah, that's, that's pretty much everything that I have to share with you guys for the week. I hope that you're having a great weekend when you see this on Sunday. I hope you're having a great weekend and a great start to your week. And I will see you guys later. Bye.